guys and welcome back to another video. Uh, this is going to be another learn tarot with me with the Emperor. So there he is sitting on his throne loving his life. So this card initially made me feel a bit uncomfortable uh, for a number of reasons. I think for the main reason um, I personally consider myself to be a part of the Divine Feminine this one card is more divine masculine to me so feeling all of that energy um is quite different from my own i feel a little bit disconnected to it a lot of the time it almost feels like kind of an i'm gonna fuck you up energy if you mess with me or like don't do me wrong like you should be worried or afraid of me um kind of threatening like I said with the quotes, kind of a don't mess with me vibe, don't mess with what I love, don't mess with what I care about because I'll fuck you up. So I feel like his energy is like Grunkle Stan from Gravity Falls, but if he was like old man Lord Zuko physically looking, that's what he reminds me of. Um, I put down he may be cautious, very aware of his surroundings. So keywords are on alert, he's protected, or protective, he's prepared to take action, uncomfortable and cautious. He looks like he is ready for something to go down. Like something bad's gonna happen at any moment. You see his eyes up here, they look like they might be kind of worried or they're on alert, waiting for anything bad to happen, I feel like. <clears throat> so next I have for love, career, and life. Um, as like if I were to do specific readings on these for love, it would be cautious to trust or to fall in love for career. Cautious of your work environment. Maybe something bad is going down on at work. Maybe... Work is unreliable and may fall apart. Feeling cautious of things. For life, it's preparing to protect something. So maybe something's going down in your life that you need to protect. For reversal, is not being prepared. You're not prepared for whatever shit's about to go down. Something might go down and you're not prepared for it. Upright is being prepared for some shit. Like, something to go down. You're ready for something. Uh, I also put, he has fought many battles in his life. Something has raised his suspicions. Um, what in the world did I write there? Oh, so I put that this card is regularly known as just kind of like a father figure. And I mean, he is kind of a fatherly figure. He reminds me of a king on his throne sort of thing. But he reminds me of the king on his throne, the guy who is protecting his castle. This is a man who's protecting his castle because he loves so much. Um, he has so much love to give and he doesn't want the things that he loves to be attacked or hurt. So he's very protective. Um, this father is searching for any threats to keep what he loves safe. Yeah, so what I just said. And then as, is that it? Yeah, that's all I wrote. So I have one, my last main thing. The emperor is a father figure focused on protecting what he loves. He's aware to all threats and is cautious of trusting others to his treasures slash what he loves. He will not let his kingdom fall. If you attack, prepare for the battle of your life. Yeah. So if you do challenge him and challenge, um his ability to be able to protect the things that he does love, prepare for all out war because this boy is ready. And again, if it's reverse, it's not being prepared to protect things, um, whether that be situational or people, not prepared to protect what, maybe it could even be a belief, not prepared to protect your beliefs. This one is all about protection. Um, Protection over things that you treasure. That's what the Emperor kind of speaks to me. That is all for the Emperor. Next up we have the Hierophant coming in. So um, I'm feeling a little bit better about the Emperor and my feelings on it. But since I, like as I said, it's still kind of 
restrictive energy because I connect more with my feminine side than my masculine side. So, of course, yeah. He's a bit fiery for me. He's very on guard and ready to fight. And, you know, to be fair, it's not for the wrong reasons. Um, he's using... He's using his power to protect the things that he cares about, and that's a good thing. And I think that's what I can really take for this card forward moving on. As I said, the Hierophant's next, so I'll see you in the next video, whatever it is. Bye!